What happened to your body if you drink too much alcohol? Today, we're tackling a topic that's all too familiar for many alcohol consumption. Specifically, what happens when you drink too much? Today, we're going to explore the intricate relationship between alcohol and our bodies. The initial effects. As soon as you take a sip of alcohol, it starts to be absorbed into your bloodstream through the walls of your stomach and small intestine. This process begins almost immediately, and within minutes, alcohol is circulating throughout your body. Now, when alcohol reaches your brain, it begins to affect your neurotransmitters, particularly GABA and glutamate. These are chemicals responsible for regulating mood and behavior. That's why you might start feeling more relaxed or outgoing after a drink or two. But as you continue to drink, things start to get a bit more complicated. Your liver, which plays a crucial role in metabolizing alcohol, can only process a certain amount at a time. When you exceed that limit, alcohol begins to accumulate in your bloodstream, leading to a variety of effects on your body. Short-term effects. So what are some of these short-term effects? Well, for starters, alcohol is a diuretic, which means it increases urine production. That's why you might find yourself making frequent trips to the bathroom after a few drinks. Additionally, alcohol can impair your motor skills and coordination, making tasks like walking in a straight line or operating machinery much more challenging. But perhaps the most concerning short-term effect of excessive alcohol consumption is its impact on your judgment and decision-making abilities. Alcohol can lower inhibitions and impair your ability to assess risk, which can lead to dangerous situations, like drunk driving or engaging in risky behavior. Long-term effects. Now, let's talk about the long-term effects of drinking too much alcohol over time. Chronic alcohol abuse can take a serious toll on your body, affecting nearly every organ system. One of the most well-known long-term effects of alcohol abuse is liver damage. Over time, heavy drinking can lead to conditions like fatty liver disease, hepatitis, and even cirrhosis, which is irreversible scarring of the liver tissue. Once cirrhosis sets in, the liver becomes unable to function properly, leading to a host of complications, including fluid buildup in the abdomen, internal bleeding, and even liver failure. But the liver isn't the only organ that bears the brunt of alcohol abuse. Excessive drinking can also damage your heart, brain, pancreas, and immune system, increasing your risk of conditions like heart disease, stroke, dementia, and certain types of cancer. So what's the takeaway from all of this? Well, it's simple moderation is key when it comes to alcohol consumption. While enjoying a drink or two in moderation is generally considered safe for most adults, excessive drinking can have serious consequences for your health and well-being. Remember to pace yourself, know your limits, and always have a plan for getting home safely if you've been drinking. And if you ever find yourself struggling to control your drinking habits, don't hesitate to reach out for help. There are plenty of resources and support networks available for those who need it. Thanks for tuning in, and until next time, stay safe and drink responsibly. Cheers. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends. And remember to subscribe to our channel for more health tips and insights.